Samsung already had curved televisions, so what's different about these new curved televisions that you're releasing at CES? Yeah, the difference about these uh, this year is it's all about the ultra high def, the UHD 4K, and the combination of that stunning technology and experience you get from 4K, combined with the immersive experience you get when you have a curved television really is something that creates a unique experience. Tim, when I look at these curved televisions, I feel they're better. I kind of feel like I'm in the picture, I'm in the motion, but I also feel like my wallet could hurt. We don't know exactly what the prices on these are going to be, but they're very expensive for people. So do you really think that my mom and dad are going to have these in their living room well, anytime soon? Uh, we think uh, that this is a really growing category. Um, the first, the UHD or the ultra high depth, which delivers 4K or four times the resolution. I think the important thing with the curved displays is that they're taking this technology and they're not just putting it in their giant, you know, prohibitively expensive televisions, 85 inch, 100 inch, that costs tens of thousands of dollars. They're taking it and putting it into TVs that are 40, 50 inches, stuff that actually gets into the homes of mass consumers. So this is the bendable television. Can I literally just walk up and start bending it with my hands? Not quite that way, but you can with a remote control. And with a simple press of the button, it enables you to actually change the shape uh, of the television. And this is really a technology demonstration about the capabilities, about where the future in display technology is going. So this isn't something that you're releasing tomorrow. It's where Samsung sees things going. Can I take one home? You got it.